Hello and welcome back. Let's expand our understanding of gateways by examining how to model with the parallel gateway. To do this, we will illustrate a small process within our cargo management process by dragging a start event, a sequence flow, activity, and a parallel gateway. The first activity in our process, we track cargo. We use a parallel gateway to illustrate that after track cargo. We complete a series of activities in parallel. Parallel gateways are used to illustrate the branching and joining of process paths. So here three process paths are taken, and a parallel process begins. An important note. Parallel doesn't mean we do all activities at once. It just means that they are done in parallel and must be completed before the process continues. So, in our example, we annotate cargo. Determine discrepancies. And verify shipment details. Each of these activities have their own runtime or processing time. However, it isn't until all are completed that our process continues, and we can record the cargo status. To bring our process back together, we join the process using the parallel gateway. This enables all process flows to join. The process sits and waits at the join parallel gateway until all activities that are active are completed. Once all activities have been joined at the parallel gateway, our process continues. And now we have all the information we need to record cargo status. We use the end event to complete our process. Thanks again for joining us. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment to hit the like and subscribe button. We look forward to seeing you again soon.